and Vadia Gold Cup. A traditional celebration of flair and elegance has been supported by the Vadia family for many years now. Another exciting event in the Indian racing calendar, this day brings together the best from the world of high heels, hats and horses. The C and Wadia Gold Cup Day at Mahalakshmi is one of our biggest days because it is run in honour of Sir Khushru Wadia, who was singularly responsible for the beautiful racetrack you see there, the gorgeous member stand, came out of a munificent donation made by Mr. Wadia 60, 70 years ago. So the RWITC always owes a great debt to the Wadia family. The fashion and glamour quotient is always on a high at the CN Vadia Gold Cup. Mrs. Maureen Vadia, an ambassador of style herself, presented an enthralling exhibition of the latest trends in the fashion industry amidst a sportingly cheery crowd. Well, today I've got 150 models from the ages of 4 to 55 competing in three different pageants. We've got from uh, the little children, then we've got the Mrs. India's, and then we also have the mega model and the manhunt contestants. So uh, it's a mixed bag and a lot of glamorous people participating. Yeah, I think it's a good event from Glad Drag. It's one of the group companies of the Wadia Group. And again, you know, my mother, who's involved in that, has been doing it for a few years uh, with adults and children and uh, ladies who are married as well. So I think it's a good thing. And the kids were the most. Uh, happy and I think mean, that was the most fun so it's it's a good day out you know for the family apart from the races to come and see something else which is interesting the contenders made their way to the paddock ready for the big race the six strong contenders comprised of Alan Dare B52 Cameron Veronese Jack Frost and Commodore and away they go for the CN Wadia Gold Cup being a little lethargic at the start is Alan Dare. And as the field settles down, it's uh, Cameron, the leader in the white and black from uh, Commodore in second in the Claret and Gold. Two lengths behind is B52. After that is Varones, is the Hyderabad challenger. Jack Frost, second last. Last of all is Alan Dare. As they pass the 2000 meter marker, the Hon Bivillard Fauna, quite a moderate pace set there by Cameron. A length and a three quarters in front of Commodore, length and a half away is B52. Length and a quarter behind is Veroness making a slight forward move with Jack Frost half a length behind towards the inside as a party 1800 in the yellow and green. Two behind at the back of the field is Alan Dare. As they run past the 1600 meter marker, it's a Cameron about two and a half lengths ahead of Commodore, length and a half away is a B52 as they run past the 1400 meter marker, Baroness is on the outside, Jack Frost is close to the rail with seven four long in balance, two behind still in the rear is Alan Dare. They are now at the far end of the track at the 1200 with two quarters remaining in the C and Radia Gold Cup. Cameron with pace slightly picking up a length on a three quarters in front of Commodore all the time in second, Veroness in third. Length and a half away is B52 with a thousand to go. Jack Frost is making headway on the outside, another two and a half length behind is Allen there. Heading towards the half a mile pole, it's uh, Cameron the leader from uh, Commodore in second, Jack Frost has moved into third, and there's Veroness with half a mile in balance on the outside there. B52, another three length behind is Alan Dash to the back marker. They're running down towards the entrance of the home stretch at Cameron, the leader from Commodore, is very prominent in second. Jack Frost being pushed on the outside. Then there's B52, Veroness, Alan Dare as the hedge turns for home. Round the turn and into the street, Cameron comes in home first. Hotly chased there by Commodore is on the outside. Another two lane behind is Jack Frost, after that is B52. But it is Commodore on the outside from Cameron to a team settling. Jack Frost is up and galloping strongly on the outside. The rest are far behind. But it is Commodore from Jack Frost. It's Commodore from Jack Frost. It's Jack Frost from Commodore. It's Jack Frost from Commodore. Jack Frost half in front of Commodore. Jack Frost gets it from Commodore. Then there's Cameron, Allen there, B52. Last of six is Veroness. 
It's a big dream again come true. He won 16 months ago and uh, a great three race and now winning a great two race is an uh, absolute dream come true. We are very, very happy and very excited Yeah, and so glad. So happy, uh, second time I won this race. Like a uh, very good race, interesting crowd in coming for uh, this race, very good. That brings us to the end of an exciting edition of the CN Vardia Cup 2017 with a new champion racing away to glory. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash etnow and don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at etnowlive. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com slash user slash etnow.